Shalom and greetings to you all in Jesus wonderful name. We are back to you again with the word of God. We welcome you all to the fellowship of the word of God. We believe that you have been enjoying the study that we are bringing to you and you're taking step to live the kingdom lifestyle. Let's go to another point today with uh, the word of god it is related to the fruit of the kingdom in first thessalonians chapter 2 verse 11 and 12 we read as you know how we exhorted and comforted and charged every one of you as a father doth his children that you would walk worthy of god who hath called you unto his kingdom and glory it's so wonderful that we are called into the kingdom of god and not only that we are called to live the kingdom lifestyle you can also refer to second thessalonians chapter 1 and verse 5 in matthew chapter 21 verse 43 we see Jesus said that the kingdom would belong to them who produce the fruits of the kingdom the fruits of the kingdom is explained in different scripture portions in the bible love joy peace and other fruits are mentioned in galatians chapter 5 verse 22 and verse 23 we also find goodness righteousness and truth all these fruits are mentioned in ephesians chapter 5 verse 9 and james chapter 3 verse 13 to 17 again righteousness peace and joy etc are mentioned in roman chapter 14 verse 17 and hebrews chapter 12 and verse 1 in all the scripture portions we find that the kingdom fruits are so important in our lives and we need to bear these fruits god has created us not only to be a part of his kingdom but also to live the kingdom lifestyle and to live the kingdom lifestyle bearing the kingdom fruit is very very important the fruits of the kingdom are produced in us after we are born again but as the scripture says we need to work worthy of the lord we need to please god by our worthy work this says this means that we need to cooperate with the spirit of god so that we can produce we can allow the holy spirit to help the fruits to be produced in and through us in first peter chapter 2 verse 11 we see that we are called to live a life pleasing unto god and also in colossians chapter 1 verse 10 the bible talks about what kind of life we need to live that we might live and walk worthy of the lord unto all pleasing being fruitful in every good work is so important for us to take a step to let the fruit of the spirit in other words the fruit of the kingdom to be produced in and through us that by this we can live a kingdom lifestyle simply entering in the kingdom is not enough but living the kingdom lifestyle is important because only through that we can glorify jesus at the same time we can 
be useful for the kingdom of god here on this earth unless and until we take a step we will not see the change we will not see the transformation in us and no transformation will come to others also may the lord bless all of us and help us to produce this kingdom fruit so that we can live only for him and bring glory to him in jesus mighty name Amen.